He gets all the action. Like, anytime there's a stunt coordinator. We're still talking about the movie, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, like... <laughs> Took a minute. In the movie. Um... <laughs> Oh my god, I have never had my very own theme music before, so thank you so much, Theo and Maximilian. That was amazing. Thank you. Welcome to First Weekend Club. Oh, nice to be here. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, you guys can stand up now. Oh, okay. <laughs> Uh, these two talented cellists are starring in their first film here. First ever feature film. First ever feature film, Warren Sonoda's The Things I Do for Money. And they're also real life brothers. Yes. Right? Yeah, um, for 18 years. For 18 years? Oh, 20 years for, uh, 20. No, 18 years. Yeah, yeah, yeah the math. So <laughs> you're, you're older, but maybe he's smarter? Oh, definitely. No, he's definitely smarter. Uh, you have two different like, skill sets that work together well. Right. He's got the, the brains. Okay, yeah. what's your skill set? I think I don't, I'm Maybe. more of like the, the the networking type. Okay. The, like, what were you What were you gonna say? Yeah, he's like the the more the more confident one who like who like talks more. I can see that already. But he's got the the technical skills. So when you make a website, he's got that. Okay, so they're like really a full circle duo here. They can play you a fantastic theme song. I really wish I had like a gown to walk into this interview with something, or even better, if I could have risen up, like just like. Next time. We'll do it for next time, definitely. And be right there. That would have been amazing. Maybe we'll do that at the premiere. Yeah, absolutely. What do you think? That's okay. It's a plan. plan, right? Yeah. How has this experience been for you? Um, it's been pretty awesome. You know, get to like, you know, you never really think you're gonna be in a film when you're practicing cello. You know. Yeah. Like, how did this even happen? Oh, that's a funny story. Like, our our mom knows the writer. She works with them, and so he contacted Warren mm -hmm. and said, "Hey, you gotta check these guys out on YouTube." And he left a comment on one of our YouTube videos, said, hey guys, awesome stuff, we should like work together or like get in touch or something. And then he, we emailed him like a few times. Okay. And then he, we didn't get a response for like two years. And then uh, just this year, uh, he contacted us up and was like, hey, do you guys want to be in a movie? And we're like, cool. Really? That's it? It was just like, cool? He, um, he invited us to Starbucks with the other writer, Gary Nolan. And then our mom came as our like kind of agent because yeah, you know how course. moms are. Stage mom. Stage mom, yeah. exactly. Um, and so we met up at Starbucks and then he, they pitched us the idea of a crime thriller starring two Japanese-Canadian cello players. And they're like, oh, we, we kind of fit the bill on that one. <laughs> we could do this. You're, you're exactly typecast for this film. <laughs> yeah, you were born to play these characters. <laughs> and I hear that there has been some action on set, you know, some mm -hmm. guns and some blood. And, like, how much fun is that? Have you been doing some stunts? Uh, we're, we're not actually involved a lot with that. Like, because, like, most of our action comes through the cello. Right. But it's just it's kind of cool how like we're sort of like surrounded by this storm of action. Oh, I like that a storm of action. Also, he gets all the action. Like anytime there's a stunt coordinator. We're still talking about the movie, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, like. <laughs> Took a minute. It, it, in the movie, um, <laughs> no, he, he the stunt coordinator is always working with theater because right. uh, the character Eli, okay. he's the one that kind of gets pushed around by bullies, yeah. and then he pushes the bullies around. Um, he's involved with like like around gunfights and stuff like that. Right. I mean, not that none of this is nice. Like bullying is bad, yeah. and yeah. gunfights definitely bad. But in the movie, it makes for excellent entertainment. It does right? yes, yeah. and there's there's so many different parts of this movie, from like music, to um, gun action, to like romance stories and everything. It's great. Oh my god, it, it, has it been exactly what you expected it would be, or has it been just a whirlwind of I was not prepared for this at all? Um, sort of a little bit of both. Like we we knew going in, like everyone was saying, like oh be careful it's hard and like long hours but yeah. uh, so we we're kind of expecting that a little bit but it's also like been like different because like you get to see really what's going on behind the scenes which you don't really get when those behind the scenes videos this is amazing you guys are like super talented how long have you been playing Ooh, about uh, 14 years each. and you bo so, both yeah yeah because we, wow. we started when we were both four or five okay before we can remember before you can remember but it came naturally how about you just play me off yeah absolutely yeah let's do it Let's do some some kind of stars. Yeah. Oh, Still perfect. Yeah. This is it, you know? This is independent filmmaking in Canada.